All right, I'll just give you guys a super quick breakdown of how I figured out how to work this thing. This is a DC flat uh, four gain switch panel that I got off Amazon. Uh, and it came with uh, the power supply uh, for this switch panel here. They came with 15 amp breakers. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> 15 amp fuses inside already. And it came with these directions telling you where power where power runs, what it's connected to, where's the ground for this, and so on and so forth. So not too too bad. You know, it tells you where positive and negative is coming from. Not too too bad. And once you have power to the blue, it should send power to each of your connecting pieces. Or, you know, light, bilge, pump, whatever case. This I'm using this for my, my boat. So whatever you plan on using it for. Um, so how I made this work, I got a 10 gauge wire coming here to a fuse or a fuse block. Um, I'm going to end up having to change my fuses out to have the proper fuse for everything I have running. But for the moment, I just put, that's a 3 amp fuse in there. Like I said, that 3 amp runs to the reds that came with the switch panel. The reds have 15 in them, 15 amp fuses in them. Um, but like I said, this is just a quick... Let me see how this works. Let me see how this runs. Okay. And I kind of don't want to move anything because stuff is still jimmy rigged at the moment. Nothing's um, put down with, you know, the proper connectors, things like that. This was just a quick test to see how she runs. So as you see, I got my yellow and black down to a negative. I'm going to end up buying a common bus bar. It's where when I hook up my 10 gauge negative terminal, um, my 10 gauge wire to my negative terminal, I have a common bus bar, which... As soon as I connect it, it'll run that negative straight through that entire thing. And so these are uh, individuals. That's what this one was. I'm going to go ahead and replace that. But for demonstration purposes, again, 10 gauge wire in to fuse block, which uh, pushes power to anything else I have attached to it, which is attached up to the switch panel itself. I'm reading 12.9 on here. Hopefully you can see that. It's not too, not too blue. <laughs> And what I did so far, I see these little two wires there going over to just a quick little light setup for my navigation light um, just to see how she works. Okay, that's just the red and black is my hot and negative or positive negative. Like I said, running back to here. I have my positive down in the bottom there. You can see that. And again, like I said, once this blue is connected, you should be able to send power to any item that you have connected. That blue right there. I, I know it looks Jimmy Rig, but... Okay, so my hot's connected down there, which is running power from the blue. And my negative comes back to the negative. Like I said, it's going to be a complete bus bar eventually. So I can have all these individual and proper connections. And back to 10 gauge, back to negative terminal. Okay. So once I have those hooked up and my switch is in the off position, which is down position, this will allow me to click up. Okay. This is a light indicator saying, hey, I'm, I'm bringing power in. I, I want power now. So through my connection there, once I flip that up, ta-da, we have light. And she's working just fine. Okay. So on, off, or off, on, off, off, on, off, on, off, on. Cool. I like it. A lot. I like it. All right, cool. So yeah, and I'm by no means a professional at this at all. I'm not an electrician. Um, <laughs> I was just trying to read the directions, talk to a few people who knew what they're talking about at my job. Um, and got this thing working exactly how it's supposed to be working. Flipper on, you're supplying power, supplying power to the item. Item says, hey, thanks for the power. And you run a negative back down to your bus bar, proper gauge. Like I said, I'm running 10 gauge. Um, proper gauge back to negative terminal. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe to, for this video. And I shall see you guys on the next one.